The Regia Marina are ready to flee out of the Mediterranean Sea. But right as the pride of our fleet was about to set sail, a large explosion in the back of its hull made it incapable of continuing. After two days of investigation, the Servizio Informazioni Militare concluded that it was set off by British spies. They know what we are planning. Our plan to leave the Mediterranean has to be scrapped. Instead, Italo Balbo opted for the least favorite option, finish off the Swiss. Before we began attacking, we set up our air force in the region and told them to start bombing all Swiss forts they could find. So we began the attack and for some reason they already had low organization. After one long month of fighting, we had finally secured the Gotthard Pass. The battle had around 9,000 dead people on our side and 11,000 on the Swiss. After we captured the city, the Swiss militias surrendered, but there are still French, British and Dutch divisions holding out in Zurich. The Germans had already begun attacking them, so we helped them out. Sadly, after around 20 days of fighting, the Germans managed to capture the city before us. But this has little importance because we have finally defeated the Swiss. And just in the right time too. In Spain the front had stalled but the British has launched a naval invasion of Barcelona. We will send our battle-hardened men from Switzerland down there to save our flank. They arrived a few days later and for the third time we are back in the city of Barcelona. With temporary stability we can now begin to expand again so that we can form Greater Italy. But most of the states we need are islands. And for now our strategy with bombing their navy hasn't worked so well. But we can do one thing, demand Dalmatia from Hungary. And they gave it to us in return for us supporting their claim of Voivodina. Pushing back the Portuguese will be hard as they have a lot of help from the British and they have entrenched themselves. Instead we will help our Iraqi allies and try to end the conflict in the Levant. We managed to encircle their whole first line of defense and at the same time Iraq had arrived to the coast. So we launched the final offensive to end it all. After some fighting we captured their only port left in Beirut. Their army was now encircled and we destroyed them. With the situation stable again, at least anywhere else than Spain, where should we continue our offensives? We have four options. The first, we will try our best to push Portugal back from where they came from. This will be extremely difficult because of total allied air superiority, but with small concentrated attacks we might be able to do it. The second, we will begin attack the French colonies in North Africa to try and liberate Spanish Africa. Sadly, supply will be a big problem. The third, we will attack down south to Ethiopia. We will be back. Supply will also be a big problem here. The fourth, we will attack Saudi Arabia to help our Iraqi allies spread their influence. This will also make us able to capture the British colonies on the Arabian Peninsula. So, where do you think we should continue our attacks? To vote, go to my community post. And if you want to see me spin the wheel live, join my Discord server. Link to join in the description. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.